Hi there, folks. This is Ian here again. Um, yeah, today I'm going to talk about a little bit about my life. You know, um, it's getting emptier behind me because I'm moving uh, somewhere else now, and uh, and the place that I'm moving to is in the center of town again, of Brühl in Germany. And um, well, as I say, a lot of things are happening in my life, and sometimes you know we tend to think uh, about life. Uh, when we don't see immediate success, we tend to think we're not successful. But if you compare your life to what it was uh, in the past, then you will be able to see that life is a progression. Now, I always believed in the uh, the, the law of attraction that uh, whatever you think upon and whatever you spend most of the time upon, thought-wise, it becomes your reality. And I always taught the fact that um, you can create your own reality through the through the way you are thinking and that's exactly what I still believe in and it's, that's the way I'm experiencing it right now. Now um, at this stage of my life I'm pretty satisfied you know life has a lot of contrasts you know there's a lot of things that happen in life and sometimes you wonder why this happens but you know it's not because you were unlucky it's simply because life happens the way it happens you see things happen the way they are and sometimes you attract them and sometimes you don't attract them but mostly, you attract the things to your life that that usually happen. Now, uh, um, I've come a long way from here. Yeah, I'm living in Germany at the moment, and I have four kids. And um, oh, uh, I'm living pretty happy life, and I'm really happy with my situation the way it is. You know, and it wasn't always like that because I was brought up in a society where negative thinking was the order of the day. You know, everybody thought negatively of each other, and uh, and I had to learn to redirect my thinking and to think positive thoughts. And then I started off a long time ago to think positive thoughts, think positive thoughts about myself and about my job and about my business. Now, um, maybe you don't know me. I'd like to also introduce myself in a better way so you can get to know me. I am, in a sense, I'm, in a, I'm, a, I'm a musician and a singer. And I sing different songs. I'm, I sing gospel songs and I sing my own songs. I sing pop songs. I just sing because... It gives me joy and gives me pleasure to sing songs. And of course, if you want to also hire me to come sing at your birthday and to come and sing, uh, to come and sing at your wedding, <laughs> I'll be so glad to do that. You just have to you give send, send me an email and I'll come over there and just entertain. No matter where you are in the world, yeah, because I love singing. And I think I was gifted with the talent of a wonderful, of a good voice, if I may say so myself. And uh, apart from being a singer, I'm also photogra a photographer. I love taking beautiful pictures, and uh, sometimes I post the pictures over on the internet. And uh, at times, I also am a motivational speaker. And now, now you may say, well, you're, you're the jack of all trades, uh, the master of none. You know, that's not the question. The question is, I just love doing all these things. And the question is always living, you know, because if you are in this world, you, you are in, I'm in this body, and I am an eternal soul within the body, and I uh, believe in expanding. I believe in expansion, and simply living everything out that is possible. You know, uh, I just do not approach life from the point of view of only, uh, you know, in the body. I'm a soul within the body, and I want to experience life in all its fullness. And I'm going to share this with you so that you can also experience life in all its fullness. If you're not experiencing life in all its fullness, there's something that's probably lacking with you, you know, and it's not a certain secret. The secret simply is live life the way it comes, just accept life, be appreciative of what is happening to you right now, appreciate everything that happens in your life. And when you do that, when you appreciate everything that happens in your life, you'll, you'll be growing, you'll be getting better, and things will become better for you, you see. It's not what you see in front of you, your reality. Like, uh, you know, like I believe I believe in the law of attraction says you just you don't see the reality and talk about the reality the way it is. You talk about what you want to see done. You talk about your future. You talk about your goals. You talk about your dreams, your aspirations, your visions. You know, every day you share your visions with others. And you will notice that things will be coming. You'll be going towards that, you know. In the history of humankind, it was the people who had vision. Because in the Bible, it even says, without a vision, the people perish. That's right. If you don't have any vision, you perish. Because there is nothing to live for. 
And if you have a vision, and the vi doesn't matter what the vision is, and my vision is for a better life for myself and a better life for my family, and a better life for my friends, and a better life for all pe people I come in contact with, and that is my vision, you see. So if you come in contact with me, because of me, you should have a better life, and that is my vision for you, and that's a vision, my vision for myself too. You know, and so without a vision, the people perish. So you have a vision, and the vision is this picture that you have. So expand your thinking, just expand it. And by expanding your thinking, you will be able to achieve anything you want. And so today, uh, I'm starting practically a new life because I'm moving somewhere else. And it's going to be different. And there's also a challenge to it. You know, there's also a goal to it as a challenge. It's something new. Something new is happening. Nothing that really happens is bad because it gives you the opportunity to grow. And this is what life is all about. We need to grow. We need to expand. What things, the way things were last year is not the same as they're going to be right now. And life is going to enfold in all its wonder, in all its tremendousness. And so let's be prepared to see life the way it is and to experience it and to also experience miracles because miracles will take place in your life. Every day is a new life. And don't forget, you create your life. You create your reality through the thoughts that you entertain in your mind. All the time you create your reality anew and we are creating a wonderful new reality with each other. You know, so whether it's business, making more business, or whether it's a love affair, or whether it doesn't matter what it is, we are really creating life in more and more of it and more abundantly. And this is what I'm sharing with you today. So thanks a lot. And I'll be talking to you again tomorrow. Bye for now.